I was 32. Uh, when I was, when I found out I had MS, my eyes weren't coming back straight. I went and see an ophthalmologist where he said, well, you got a more of a serious problem thing. You should go see a neuro ophthalmologist where they confirm me I had MS. I looked for the best doctor in Montreal because I'm from Montreal, Canada. I just got into the system. Medications, injections, uh, uh, yearly change from daily injections to uh, weekly injections, with, which uh, would give you you'd feel bad for about two days, you were uncomfortable. Uh, I was just injecting myself with whatever was out there and whatever I knew, whatever my, my neurologist told me to, would give me. At first, uh, I didn't really have symptoms. And what I found out when I got my second episode, and that's when I found out I had really MS. Uh, uh, that, that scared me that my left leg wasn't following anymore as much. Uh, my right eye, it's basically a nystagmus came along. That was my second, that was basically 15 years later. So I was, for me, MS was nothing, nothing happened to me. I was taking the medications. I had numbness in my fingertips. Um, uh, that kind of went away after my first treatment with Stem Cells of America. And then I came across Stem Cell of America, which was basically the one that made the most sense to me. The procedure got me here. I was very interested. And what got, I've been coming here for what, three years now? I hadn't done an MRI in a while because the doctors, they said, were always telling me, you have a mess, you have a mess, why waste? your time knowing you have more lesions or so on and so on. So I did an MRI right before I did my first um, stem cell here at uh, Stem Cell of America and I had big lesions here and there um, and afterwards uh, where they had done one of uh, two years prior to that one you saw it was progressing after I did the stem cells here so stem, stem Cell of America a year after, I did another MRI and everything was kind of at a standstill and actually some are, some lesions are not as active and kind of receding a bit. I think um, in the progression it kind of halted and it took a little step back. So for me, a little step back just even if I would have stayed at the same place, but even a little step back, that's positive. I say I had MS, now with, with Stem Cells of America, what I'm doing is I'm, I'm repairing, uh, I'm fixing um, the lesions mm -hmm. that MS left. We're mm -hmm. cleaning up the mess mm -hmm. with Stem Cells of America. Mm -hmm. And I'm very confident about it. Uh, my eyes, uh, I have a nystagmus of the eyes. Also, slowly but surely, it's, um, I'm still taking the pills, but the effect of the pills uh, are, are faster. The staff is curious from the first person you contact, the whole staff, the procedure is is easy going and it's safe. After the treatment, I have no downsides. I feel um, actually happy. I got up, up and go. I go back home. Uh, I take, I rest and then I get going with my day. It's safe and it's not just for MS. For me, it's 100% it's uh, being controlled uh, uh, by the stem cells. I do feel better. I am better. It's working.